And welcome back to the channel, my people. So happy to have you here. Hope you guys are having a great day. Hope you saw yesterday's video. It was pretty cool, actually. We found another Liberty Walk R34 hauler. Thanks to Ron, of course. He found it first. And was gracious enough to offer it to the Florida man. I mean, I couldn't say no to that, right? Who would, who would? But then of course we got another one in the mail from Nugs Toys, tag you right here, Nugs Toys. Great guy from Instagram, also a whatnot seller. Uh, hooked up the Florida man with some stuff to donate or he donated so that we could do a really cool auction uh, and fundraise more for Hurricane Ian. It was really cool to see uh, some of you guys in Donald's auctions, Flying Disc Customs. Uh, so that was really, really fun. I did some whatnot surfing and if you saw yesterday just to check out other auctions see what was going on we're definitely going to start the live auctions for the customs which will be next friday i believe it's the 28th we're going to start at 11 a.m so ron and i will begin the show i'm going to do a really cool wheel swap ron will have some really cool customs and then we'll pass the show on to the next person the next person so on so on so on. all right my people i do have an m2 case here it's probably the box stuff I'm not sure what's going to be in here. Yeah, 164, some type of box, quantity 12. Let's see what's going to happen. Oh, yeah, my knife skills are awesome. Holy cow, look at these guys. This is crazy. Chevrolet Camaro M2. Uh, oh, Power Flowers. That is the theme. Unbelievable, 9,600 pieces. I don't know what a chase would be or could be. You know, sometimes they don't even have it. So we don't know. Oh, look at that beautiful Camaro. Oh, there's a Superbird in there. Oh, wow, Nova Gasser. This is so exciting. Really, I'm not even kidding, my people. Torino Cobra. Don't love that one. Uh, flower Power. Oh, Power Flower Volkswagen Delivery Van 1960. What a beauty. Here's the Superbird. Holy cow. There's a little scratch on the top, unfortunately. Don't love that, but I certainly love... Oh, it's a Daytona, not even a bird. That's even more right, rare. box number two. Same stuff, obviously, but maybe we'll see something cool. I don't know. I don't think so. I'm not catching the vibe, honestly. I'm not catching it. Camaro again. Torino. Two more to go. What's going to happen? Nothing. All right, no big deal. Love the Superbird. Wow, this one's like perfect. I'm gonna get this one. Totally getting this one. All right, we have the next Walmart. What a cool set. Power Flower, come on now. I'm down with that. Little 70s, little 70s vibe on the, on the Daytona. But yeah, we're at the next Walmart now. We'll see what's going on. Maybe we'll find something cool. Maybe not. Who knows? Right. There is nothing going on at this Walmart again. I don't know what's going on here, man. They are just hurting on supply. Uh, I can't figure it out. But it used to be a great store. I don't know what happened. All right, let's check one more Walmart for this part of the video. Anyway, Ron is really excited to do a whatnot live stream. He even like did an orientation. This guy is prepared, bro. So yeah, uh, I think it's October 28th, Friday the 28th, 11 a.m. EST. We'll kick off the show. It's gonna be so fun. Ooh, snacks and beverages. Loving that one. Here we go. Local cruisers from the Matchbox. Uh, you know, the C8, probably the better of the collection. Is it the same as the main? Probably. Mustang convertible, also very nice from the local cruisers. Not seeing much else here I'm really interested in, and I gotta be honest. Hey, my people. Cool, we got to check some M2 machines, I guess. In one case, whatever. Better than nothing, right? There's gotta be new premiums. There's gotta be new stuff coming in anytime now. New Auto World 2 packs. I've heard, I've heard rumors about a new release of 2 packs with like an El Camino, another Buick, Ultra Reds. These ones have red tires. And now for everyone's favorite segment of the Florida Man videos, show and tell with the Florida Man. But yeah, check it out guys. 
These are called convention cars. I'm not sure how many of you are even aware of these. You even know that these exist. I gotta be honest, I gotta be honest. These are very cool. So every year, Hot Wheels does the Legends Tour, but they also have something called the Hot Wheels Annual Collectors Convention. They have them in Los Angeles. They have them in North Carolina and maybe other places. I only really know of these two because I have these these cars here. Uh, but yeah, you have to go to the event and you have to get tickets to the event. I guess you get them early. I know Ralph goes to quite a few of them. He did not get the tickets to that one, unfortunately. Uh, well, he, he did get it to this specific show, the 35th. But the one from, oh, 2021 I got this? What? Oh, last year. Okay, that's okay. Duh. Yeah, so the 36th annual convention, uh, uh, Ralph did not get tickets. He did try. He wasn't able to get tickets. Here's an example of what you can get when you go to the collector's convention. They have uh, a, a group of cars, basically. I want to say it's like five because you can purchase, let's say, these two, and then you go to a dinner, and then they give you like a dinner car, and then if you have multiple tickets you know you have another person with you they'll get a dinner car so people go and they bring friends and they try to basically get as many of these convention cars as they can get this is the honda s2000 so this is number two of three uh, i i I, I want I, I don't remember what was three. Ralph would know. I can ask him. I think it was a Dodge, but I could be wrong. So uh, here's number one of three, the, the Blazer, the, uh, what does it say? 72-wheel drive Chevy Blazer. I mean, look at that thing, dude. It is straight custom. Love the blue. Love the flames. It's got the same wheels front and back. And, uh, and I love that wheel, that, that chrome five-star kind of deal. Looks great. The S2K is number two, and uh, Ralph, uh, he got a few extra cars, and he gave me these at an amazing price. Not only that, Ralph asked me, well, not only that, but I told Ralph, dude, just give me the higher numbers. Numbers, you say? Yeah, they're numbered, dude. So 809 out of 6,200, he gave me his second lowest number. I'm like, no, no, you know, keep the low one, sell them, man, it's okay. He's like, no, no, I, I want you to have it. I want you to have it. And he gave it to me, 809 out of 6,200. I mean, that's below a 1,000, dude. That's so cool. And I think the blazer is low also. Let's check. Uh, yeah, 2691. It's not as low as the S2K, but... Still, it was his second lowest out of, I think he got four uh, of these, I guess, maybe. I don't, I don't know. I don't remember. I don't remember why I don't have all three, but there was a reason. Uh, maybe I didn't like it. I, I, can't, I, can't remember. I can't remember. I can't remember my people. My buddy Diecast Dez, he, uh, he's from the Instagrams, and he lives in L.A., and he went to the convention in 21 also, and he got, well, so Ralph, these are from the 22nd annual, this is from North Carolina, so I don't understand, I guess, I guess 30, they did it 35 times, now 36 in L.A., and I guess only 22 at this point in North Carolina, again, uh, I don't know a lot about the, the convention. I just know that they have really cool cars. They show things that are coming in the future, like uh, uh, prototype models of Hot Wheels and castings, and people can just put hands on them and check them out, and it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Oh, there's some words back there. What is that? I never noticed the words back there. I'm going to read it. It says... 35th Annual Collector's Convention, LA, California, October 6th through the 10th, 2021, and then Dotson below it. Very cool. So the Dotson uh, 240Z, Advan kind of theme there with the, the red lines, very Advan-y, if you ask me. But yeah, that's uh, something Diecast does. He lives in LA, and he got this for me. Oh, 817? Wow, I didn't know that was this low. I thought it was a little higher. Wow, 809 on the S2K and 817 on the 240. That is so cool. I don't know what we're... Oh, just like a little something on the protector there. Yeah, the car's fine. It's so cool. It's got like a wide body deal. Man, when he he was like, hey, I could get you this, you know. Do you want it? You want it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I zelled that money right away. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? 
But yeah, I just want to show you these convention cars for show and tell today. I know you guys like seeing some of the cool stuff from the collection. Uh, these will never be for sale and will be buried with the Florida man. Okay, uh, thanks to whoever bought the Blazer and thanks to whoever bought the Johnny Lightning Import Heat. It's going out today. Really appreciate you guys. You're going to get some real nice... Uh, die cast here. I made sure to inspect the packages. Uh, one of the blazers I noticed had a little crimp here, so I put it back, luckily, because uh, I don't want to send anything out that I wouldn't want to own personally. I'm going to say that the convention cars are probably like the most highest end Hot Wheel you could get as far as, you know, Hot Wheels goes. I, I would think this is like the top of the echelon, the top of the of the hill, so to say, when it comes to the convention cars they're definitely probably like the most elusive exclusive car since you have to go to the convention to get them or or buy them from someone who did all right i'm gonna pack up these orders for you guys and head over to the post office and take a little break and then uh, maybe we'll do some more hunting but you won't know until the next video so thank you so much for watching today's video i know it was short uh, Walmart's just not where it's at right now. Yeah, we got some boulevards. That was cool, but I haven't really seen much else come in there. So maybe like some Zamic cases are going to show up sometimes when there's a little break. It's because something special is coming. Let's hope. Fingers crossed. I'll see you in the next one.